Hi guys, it's Kate from Cater and I'm out here in the garden to give you your weekly tour. Today is September 2nd uh, and I really wanted to shoot today because last year I have a video that I shot on September 2nd so I really kind of wanted to do a comparison. Um, so yeah, I'm going to take you around and today we'll be looking just at the cannabis and how my flowers are coming along. So here we go. Okay, so I'm standing on this concrete bench and just to give you some idea of the height of this plant, this is the plant that fell over in the big storm. So she's completely recovered, although I have left the branches that I put down here propping her up just in case, I don't know, anything else happens. Uh, she's just my tallest, well, yeah, I'd say she's my tallest. And here's where her flowers are at. So she's coming in. And, you know, I expect those flowers to be pretty, pretty long, beautiful tops. This is also a very tall plant. This came from a seed that I did a trade with a grower on Instagram from the States. And uh, it's supposed to be a purple OG. Oops, and let's see the flowers. There we go. So it's in flower. The spacing between the nodes on this plant is quite big. I've never grown it before. Let's see. This is an Alaskan purple. I have grown this um, for years now. And you can see, oh, sorry, my air conditioner just kicked in. You can see um, she's not as tall, but real nice flowers. That's the top. Uh, I guess we'll go over here next. So here's the trellis. And um, we'll take a look at what some of these look like. This plant is an AK-47, a seed that was given to me by another grower. Oops, I've never grown it before, but looking really nice. Got a bit of a chewed up leaf here, but something had a snack. Uh, coming on over, trellis. Just beautiful, right? I'm gonna duck under. And this is my Moby Dick. Now, she's not getting a lot of light right now. There's my Moby Dick right there. So, flowers are looking really nice. Yep. There's a nice top going up through the trellis. And what I'm not seeing is powdery mildew. Okay, this is a Master Kush. I've grown this for years. Very tall, probably comparable to um, that first god bud I showed you, my really tall plant. But this one's in a raised bed, so I guess technically it's not quite as tall. And the flowers are oh, looking about like that. Yep. All right, here's my bag seed in the corner, which is just gorgeous. I don't know what this is, but boy, she's fat. I'm assuming she'll finish first. I have not taken a look at the trichomes at all yet. Um, pretty happy. Looks like a ti the tiniest bit of mildew on these leaves, but honestly, I'm just kind of leaving it right now. Oops. I'll probably come out and do a spray. I don't know. It's really not... Uh, not that bad. This is a, I don't know what this is. I think it's a Moby Dick. This is the one I was going to give away. She's only in a 10 gallon, so 10 gallon pot. There's where her flowers are. So uh, there's only one plant I haven't, oh, I should show you. I built these beautiful gold frames. Oh, I can't believe I skipped right over that. I found these windows um, on the side of the road and I got some scrap wood from my neighbor's backyard and I built a cold frame for growing some greens uh, over the winter and also um, sprouting some seedlings in the spring and here's another one so I built this oh shoot sorry dropped you um, I built this in between my raised beds and what I did was I installed a continuous hinge which I'm going to do on the other one now that the box is built and this one can open which is beautiful. I'm very excited. I did this myself. Oops, it's caught on the trellis. There we go. Down. Okay. Yeah, 
Yeah, so that was a cool little project. I guess I'll take you back around this way now uh, to the last plant, which is, you know, to be honest with you, I'm not entirely sure what this spring is. I'm trying to think. I'm not sure. Uh, some kind of sativa. It's, I'm thinking maybe it's a master kush as well. And she's only in a 20 gallon, so you know she's only gonna get so tall, but there's some flowers. There we go. So looking beautiful. So yeah, that's where I'm at, guys. My beautiful garden. Very happy with this. Grow season. Um I haven't had a grow season like with weather like this in gosh, as long as I can remember. You know, and I know we've still got weeks to go with, you know, cooling temperatures and high humidity. And I know I'm gonna have to get back here and spray, but gosh darn it, it has been absolutely beautiful. So there's your update. All of them are kind of in different stages of flower, right? So anyway, I'll come back in a week and uh, I'll give you another call. So until then, Happy, healthy growing. I hope you're having a great time. Until next time, I'm Kate from Cater, and I will see you later.